Gemini, this is welcome Virgos. <laughs> welcome Virgos. This is the Gemini season. The Gemini season begin from May 21st until June 20th. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for the wonderful live shares and support. All right, let's go in and see what is transpiring. Oh, so um, Virgos, you're in the sixth house. And Gemini's are in the third house okay so you have to understand um, how things affects you now the third house is about environment okay and uh, it's about the reception of how you see people and situations okay and a lot of you you're going to be dealing with um, a heartbreaks because some sort of a secrecy is going to be coming out for you Virgos and I see you were hoping for some sort of emotional balance that is in reverse. And I see truth is going to be revealed over a Scorpio, uh, a scorpion. Now you have two major arcana. Two major arcana is here in week, um, the second week and the last week. Two major arcana, but the last week you're going to be finding out like a lot of stuff that was happening and transpiring, and you were not even aware of it. Who you're going to be dealing with in this period, the Librans, which is not very positive dealing with the Librans. And um, then the energy of the moon um, is a situation where there is some sort of an emotional secrecy that is going to be coming out. The moon is about illusion and it's about the Scorpion and the Pisces. So, so some of you are going to be dealing with some sort of an issue with the Scorpion and the Pisces. It's coming up as the Scorpion. And the truth is going to be coming out because I see again an Angman energy. Angman energy is also the energy of the Pisces. It's Neptune. So a lot of you are dealing with um, Libran, Pisces, Libran, Pisces, and Scorpion in this Gemini season. Okay, a lot of you. And you're going to be finding out something in the last week because your major weeks is going to be the week of the 28th and the 20 and the 3rd. And the last week, uh, the week of the 11th and the 20th. Okay. All right. So when we have the energy of the three of swords, uh, everyone thinks of one thing, loss and heartbreak. Okay. And it is Saturn in Libran. So some sort of a transition is going to be coming up between some of you and a Libran. All right, Saturn is bringing back discipline in some sort of a connection between some of you Virgos and a Libran. What, whoever this Libran is, whatever this Libran has done, I see that there is going to be some sort of a changes between you and a Libran. So be aware of this. Uh, open up yourself because it's Saturn in Libra. And Saturn is about um, um, changes. Saturn is about... Uh, um, the repetition, the reputation. Saturn is about bringing back discipline in corporation institution and bringing back discipline between you and a Libran in some capacity. Okay, so again, I see a Libran is heartbroken and a Libran is uh, spying on some of you. Whatever is transpiring, I see that some of you Virgos is going to be recognizing what a Libran have done to you. Some of you Virgos is going to be recognizing that a Libran was the one who threw you under the bus. Some of you are dealing with a Libran that has created a whole lot of issues for you where you Geminis are really heartbroken over this Libran and what this Libran have done. So discipline, Saturn is about um, the reputation. Saturn is about this person could have ruined your reputation and this is why you're so heartbroken. It doesn't have to be a Libran. It can be anyone. Okay. But you got to understand when Saturn is in Libran, it's about someone, some sort of a loss and it was created. It has something to do with a Libran. Okay. A Libran could have ruined your reputation. A Libran could be creating a whole lot of issues for you. A Libran is trying to create a whole lot of problems. It could be um, an investigation. It could be someone spying on you and lying um, on you. Okay, so uh, whatever is transpiring, this is not very nice. This is not good for you, Virgos. And uh, um, you, Virgos, have to be aware if you feel as if something isn't 
good you know um, it is not good because you know if you are connected with a Libran and you're not trusting this person don't trust this person it's not good all right it's what it is the energy of the moon in reverse so um, the energy of the moon is that a whole lot of secrets some sort of a secret is going to come out that is going to be breaking your heart Librans and it's as if um, Virgos and it's as if a Libran have created this but it can be also investigation it can be also um, corrupt civil servants okay um, that can also be the fact that corrupt civil servants you know people who lie and try to cover up their um, cover up what they are doing um, you are going to be recognizing this Virgos that you're dealing really with some corrupt people some sort of a corrupt authority figure and um, you know it, it, it's as if some sort of a, a truth is going to be coming out and some sort of a secrecy that was held held you're going to be recognizing so um Ladana the servants that this that this this Ladana is um, a working person okay um, and you Virgos are going to be finding out uh, a whole lot of secrets about someone at the workplace it's a young lady whenever the energy of um, this LaDonna comes out um, this is a situation where whoever this young lady is okay uh, you are going to be finding out um, yeah it's a young um, uh, yeah a woman that was employed but this person is young this person is no more than 45 years old okay and uh, you could have um, employed this person okay it's a female co-worker you're going to find out something about this female co-worker all right and uh, they're going to be finding out that you Virgos did something for this female for um, co-worker um and for some of you men um it's about uh you have an affair with this female uh, co-worker for some of you women is that this female co-worker have stabbed you in the back and it's a scorpion or a pisces some sort of a secrecy is going to be coming out about a female co-worker so you um men and women um you gotta be um aware of this person because their secrets is coming out um so you could be finding out something that this person was not honest okay and it's a co-worker you can either um employ this person or this person a per co-worker but whatever is transpiring you're you um and, and there's a whole lot of gossip gossiping backstabbing this co-worker have done all right and created a whole lot of issue and you Virgos are now recognizing what has been happening what has been transpired okay and you Virgos are now aware of what this co-worker have done so um, you know Virgos this is a serious serious timeline there is no question about this this is just absolutely absolutely a serious timeline and you know whoever this co-worker is their secret is coming out and it's as if uh, um, some of you Virgos uh, um, was not aware of what this co-worker was up to and their secrets comes out okay so, and I see you're very heartbroken so this co-worker could be a Libran okay definitely this co-worker could be a Libran and you're going to be recognizing that this co-worker has backstabbed you and it is as if oh my god I can't believe it you know this person is really a BS um, and I see sadness but whatever the secrets that comes out you're going to be happy that the secrets come out because you know you can move on emotionally you can heal the situation and just move on in a week of um, the um, fourth until the 11th fourth until 11th I see some sort of an emotional balance is here a whole lot of emotional balance whatever is happening whatever is transpiring there is a whole lot of emotional balance and you know the situation is is that you recognize that you're going to be overcoming 
um, what this person have done. Some sort of an unexpected emotional situation is going to be coming in and um, expect some sort of a written um, uh, communication, some sort of a paperwork that a lot of you were waiting for it is going to be happening. Okay. So um, a grand gesture of really positive, positive energy um, that is going to be coming in for a lot of you unexpected um, success is going to be happening in the third week for a lot of you um, and you know your success with mini minimal um, effect that are going to bring great outcomes so you know prosperity luck um, a raise in pay okay um, increase in your financial stability um, it's a good week to buy um, buy a ticket you know a scratch off whatever it is um, because this is um, really going to be um, good and you know this is like short-term happiness is going to be coming in short-term happiness and that is going to be short-term emotional happiness and you know this is absolutely fabulous because you know when we look at the energy of um, the seven of cups the energy of the seven of cups is about Venus in scorpion so a lot of you are going to be successfully overcoming a scorpion whatever a scorpion has done some sort of unexpected surprise and success overcoming a scorpion um, because the seven of cups is Venus in scorpion and the seven of cups is in reverse and what is happening and transpiring is that some of you are really dealing with a scorpion and something that a scorpion have done you're going to be unexpectedly um, <clears throat> overcoming what this person have done to you now it could be a scorpion but it could be um, someone else that uh, creates some sort of an imbalance <coughs> <coughs> sorry emotionally imbalanced okay but it's going to bring you success so it could be a situation where someone tried to pull the rug underneath your feet and then you fall good because something unexpected happened to you so this is the sense of what could be transpiring where a scorpion whoever the scorpion is or whoever this person is try to pull the rug from under your foot and then all of a sudden you just flip up and just stand and unexpected help so a scorpion at the workplace could be working against some of you and all of a sudden they are worked out and you receive a, a, um, um, success by recognizing what they were doing and pick it up on time in order to bring it in in a shape of energy and this is going to be good so some sort of unexpected surprises is going to be happening this is really a success event that is going to be transpiring then we have the last energy the energy of the eye and the hangman and it is in the upright position it's in a reverse but the upright position because you're no longer waiting and going within yourself you are now recognizing and seeing what has been happening in your face okay it is about um, the last week the fourth week you're seeing exactly what is happening in your face okay so now you have an idea of what was transpiring um, behind your back because obviously you got a loss um, some sort of a loss come in the first week and this loss was created uh, by people who were creating a whole lot of issue and the secrets about a young lady and this is uh, the secrets of a uh, Libran a Pisces or a scorpion a young lady is going to be coming out and whatever the scorpion person have done they tried to pull the wool the rug from underneath your feet and they got fall in it and that is so good and in the fourth week um, Virgos um, you Virgos in the fourth weeks are really looking at a situation and is recognizing oh my god because this Angman energy is about you are no longer meditating you're seeing the truth of what was happening and you are thinking oh my god I never see this coming I never saw that this was going to be happening and you are putting the uh, puzzles of the pictures together in order to uh, get out of the situation and recreate 
some sort of a better stability in your world because here you are out of the angman position you recognize you went in in you connect using the pisces energy and went in in connect with your higher self meditated and now you're seeing the truth of what was going on because it was as if people were creating some sort of an illusion around you okay and now gemini remember gemini is the energy of here and gemini is and the just gemini season is going to be releasing you out of the illusion and this is why i said gemini's and uh, virgos you're very good because you are ruled by mercury mercury is the planet of communication okay and you gemini's uh, is helping you virgos to, to to see the truth of what was going on so it's as if you are being removed out of an illusionary situation that was created in your world. Someone was weaving some sort of an illusionary situation so that you weren't seeing what was going on. And it has to do with a Libra. So Virgos, um, this is going to be um, a really exciting time because at the end of this Gemini, um, season because Gemini's protect you Virgos okay because Gemini's is a um, is ruled by Mercury you are also ruled by Mercury and this Gemini season is going to let you Virgos see a lot of things because people were trying to create illusion and you were standing in the midst of this and you step back because in the beginning you re recognize what was happening and you recognize a young woman okay and this is a water sign young woman a Pisces cancer a scorpion young woman okay you recognize what this young woman this young woman has been um, weaving her whole little play and has been getting you Virgos caught up in her whole little play her whole little system she had everything under control she was basically controlling a whole lot of situation and this person for some of you could come up as your daughter this person could come up for some of you as someone at workplace. This person could come up for some of you as your children are in relationship with this person. But whatever it is, I see, um, you know, art breaks is really here for a liberal woman. And I see this liberal woman try to control a situation. And a liberal and a Pisces Cancer Scorpion, whoever these people are, their secrets are coming out. Because some a young lady was trying to work again some of you Virgos but it's not going to be happening because they tried to um, flip you over and they got really caught up in this situation so I see a lot of you are going to be recognizing that a Libran young lady had a lot of secrets whoever this Libran young lady is um, this Libran young lady had a lot of secrets a Libran a scorpion and a Pisces young lady had a lot of secrets and a lot of you are going to be recognizing that these people had a lot of secrets and you're going to be uh, um, really seeing the truth of who um, a Libran, a Pisces, uh, a Cancer and a Scorpion person is because I see that uh, you Virgos are onto this person and is recognizing the, the play that this Virgo this person try to bring out young ladies some sort of unexpected luck is going to be coming in for some of you uh, Virgo young ladies some of you young ladies some sort of a emotional problems with relationship unexpected help um, some sort of a problem you are having at workplace I see a lot of you are going to be getting some sort of a raise or a salary for you women at the workplace um, some sort of a, a small success is going to be coming up for you Virgo ladies at the workplace and some sort of a unexpected financial gain is going to be coming up so young ladies you have um, some luck um, in the this um, time um, spend use it it is going to be helping you a lot of men and businessmen is going to be recognizing what a young lady have done against you okay whoever this young lady is um, and um, you know you men are going to be overcoming a scorpion and a Pisces you men are going to be recognizing some sort of a foul play 
you men are going to be recognizing that a young lady had pulled a wool over your eyes for a very long time but now you're going to be recognizing um, that this is not going to be working you know what this person have done you have some luck and you are going to be resolving this situation okay so I gotta go I do love you guys remember to choose your crystal okay it is very important go um, choose your crystal if you have um, and see what exactly is going to be happening and taking place choose your crystal and I want to say please like share these videos share 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 subscribe namaste until next time